we're doing something a little bit different and the sun is right in my face and I forgot my sunglasses so yeah it's Friday oh, okay let's start so today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different I'm gonna continue vlogging and doing all my shenanigans but from now on I'm gonna do morning thoughts it requires me to put on my camera every morning whether I have my makeup or not it doesn't matter before I go to work and from the moment that I get out of the house and I drive all the way to my work I'm gonna give I'm gonna be giving you my thoughts about the day the weather whatever the hell I want you know why because I thought it would, it would be fun no maybe I don't know bear with me let's see if you guys like it and if you guys don't like it well you know don't watch it and just watch my other stuff and if you guys don't like any of my stuff then go somewhere else because this is my channel hold on please hold where you going buddy please he's texting people don't know how to drive really the green light went for me to go and he went stupid people man anyways so what was I saying? It's Friday. We are gonna. I'm gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna start doing this segment every morning. It doesn't matter whether I vlog or do a different video. These these morning thoughts are gonna go out the day after I film them, and they're gonna be daily. Okay. So right now I'm gonna start with all the days that I work. So from Monday to Friday at least you will get them. And and. The good thing about it is that you might get two videos a day. So this one is always gonna go up at 10.30, okay? 10.30 from Monday to Friday. And then, I mean, unless I work on a weekend, then I will do morning thoughts. So I'm driving somewhere, okay? But for now, morning thoughts are in the morning every time I work, I work, I work. How you guys doing? This person right next to me, I don't know where you wanna go. Really, really? Oh my God, I wish my car, had like a little poster that will go up and I can type here like while I'm driving I can be like bitch get in your lane use your blinker look around you before going swear that if my car was able to do that I would get in so much trouble because I would be like telling everyone like really blinker please it's not that hard there is a reason why cars are blinkers do you know that it's so you put it so I know where you're going I cannot guess where you're going and then what's the point of having the blinkers if you're not gonna use them I'm going to work I only work one shift um, I don't work a double and right after work I'm gonna come home and I'm gonna edit I have to edit my blog I have to edit uh, this video and I have to edit Oh, nada más. That's it. I started Blogmas a couple days ago and I actually did a Blogmas and then I started recording for the Blogmas but I never did an ending so now I have like three days. Did you see my nail? Horrible, huh? I have three days worth of like Blogmas so I'm just gonna smoosh them all together and do one video. So let's see how that goes. Any plans for Christmas? I don't have yet plans for Christmas. Other than I know that on the 24th I'm gonna see my family as usual and then on the 25th we're gonna be with Tyler's family for brunch so we do the Peruvian oh my goodness oh my goodness sorry guys we're gonna do the Peruvian um, Christmas on the 24th right at midnight and all that and then we're gonna do the um, American Christmas on the 25th in the morning um, to open presents and have brunch and all the good stuff as well so it should be fun. It should be fun. A lot of food. I've been trying to take care of my eating, but you know what? I actually haven't been really good. I've just been okay. I've been eating healthy one day, one meal, and then I freaking stuff my face with an apple pie later. Uh, it's so hard to eat healthy. I just can't. I just can't. I don't know why. I just love food. If, you know. Quick fact: If 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 the if there were not any consequences of on eating everything that you want and consuming as much sugar or fat or whatever that you want, and you know I didn't have to go to the gym or like eat healthy to be a skinnier or like to be lean in a healthy weight, I would definitely be like the biggest woman in the world. Definitely, if there was not consequences of me getting sick, 
I would be the biggest woman in the world because I love chicken wings, beer, I love apple pie, I love eating, I love sushi, I love eating everything. Like I, I don't discriminate when it comes to food. I eat everything. So, but I have three ulcers, so I can't do that. I had a beer the other day, or more like three or two. I don't know. The numbers fluctuate. <laughs> and my God, I feel like I drank a. 24 pack by myself. I feel like shitty. I felt like my belly was like, like you know, having trouble. It doesn't go well with me. And as much as I try to stay away from beer, I love beer and it, it is hard for me. So we'll see. Maybe um, I'll learn. I need to take care of my eating. If you guys have any tricks about ulcers, let me know. I would highly appreciate it because I can't eat anything. I can't eat a spicy. I can't eat tomatoes, Brussels sprouts. Even Brussels sprouts actually make my belly weird. So it's so hard to live with an ulcer. Imagine living with three. On another note, I'm so late for work. Actually, I'm not so late. I'm just a little late. I had to stop at Starbucks because I was starving. Talking about food, I woke up starving. I ate last night, but I don't know. It's weird. I just woke up like so hungry this morning. So I was like, no, I need to go and get food. If not, I get very cranky. I get hungry. You guys have no idea, but I'm the type of person that I need a sneaker. If not, I'm like, Wah! and I become Godzilla. I just don't do well when I'm hungry. I'm not me when I'm hungry. All right, we're off the freeway. Get out of my way. I was listening to the radio and then, uh, you know the JB show, if you guys are from the Bay Area, the 94.9, they were talking about like some cheese festival that happened and then the vegans went on the festival or something and it started a riot and then it started like, you know, getting mad at the people there and the people there started getting mad at the vegans and they ended up in a fight. It's crazy. I mean, you know, uh, all respect for all the people that eat that whatever they want, and all the respect for all the people that are vegans and vegetarians and whatnot. Those are your guys' beliefs. Everyone else is have their own beliefs, and you guys are, you know, I'm saying you guys, but like in general, anyone, even someone that eats meat and get mad with vegan people, um, let them be. It's not your stomach. It's not your eating. So don't go anywhere trying to start a fight or, or start a riot if someone wanted to become vegan they will do it but if they want to eat cheese they want to eat cheese the same goes the other way for people that like meat or like all their stuff you know like they eat whatever and then they meet someone that is vegan and they're rude to them well you know that person is choosing to do what they believe so back off you know, you cannot force them to eat meat if they don't want to. I believe that the people that was at the festival, they should have handled it different. Their security team should have handled it different. Um, but, ah, oh my eyes. But overall, the way that they said it at the JB show was a very, very, very funny story. Let me tell you. It was so funny the way that they um, talked about it. So, if you guys have the opportunity to go to 90... Uh, 94.9 I think it is or oh, their website I've never been to the website but if you guys want to read about it that's where I heard it on the radio I'm almost at work and I haven't finished my makeup I only did my foundation and then a little bit of um, whatever that is bronzer oh, but I have to do my lashes so I don't look like an alien because all my lashes are white from the foundation right now but I do it after I open, you know, the store. So, uh, I just want to be in bed right now. I woke up, okay? My, my goal was to wake up at 8. And Tyler had to go to a dentist appointment and he had to wake up earlier. When his alarm went off, I woke up. So then, for like a whole hour, like that was around 7, I believe. So for a whole hour, I was like trying so hard to fall back asleep. But I couldn't. And then finally, finally, when I did, and I was like feeling like, okay, good. Like, good, good, good. I'm gonna get like a little bit of a sleep. Boom! My alarm goes. Don't you hate that? Can I park here? Yes? No? Maybe? They're doing 
doing construction, so it's like some pain in the butt. There it goes. There it goes. There it goes. Okay guys, so I just parked. So we are done with the morning thought of today. Let me know what you think about these segments. I'm gonna start doing them every single day. Um, at least every day that I work, to be more clear. And they're gonna be up the next day at 10.30. 10 30 okay always the same time because by that time i'm coming to work and i can actually do all my social media and uh, you guys know that it's been published you guys have any uh thoughts about it or if you guys think that i should research topics to talk about in the morning let me know i mean sometimes i just wake up and then i have all these thoughts in my head and i just ramble around so don't expect anything like too complex I'm gonna still do my blogs and everything else that I always do and I hope you guys like it I mean, I just thought it was fun because the other day um, Well, not the other day, yesterday, Thursday I turned on my phone and I did one of these Because I was feeling a little bit down or whatever and I just kind of like talked And I didn't do it with the intention of actually uploading it I just did it because sometimes I record just to record because um, I really wanna, you know, talk to someone it's a way to bend so anyways so I did it and I liked it and I thought you know I can make something out of this and let's see if people like it maybe you guys have thought in the morning that you guys want to share it but you guys I'm not sure well let me know let me know Mwah. don't forget to watch subscribe and comment so yeah you guys know it please please subscribe to my channel it's just not that hard all you have to do is click here click here yes for my face here okay thank you and watch all of my other videos let me know which ones you like better and which content you want me to keep doing like usual i always listen to you guys Mwah. thank you so much for the first episode of morning thoughts and i hope you guys liked it if not oh well just when i was saying bye to you guys i looked up and there is a picture in that window right there i don't know if you guys can see it there I was like, huh. I thought that a giant was looking at me for a minute. <laughs> it scared me. Okay, bye.